good morning everyone hello welcome back to a brand new vlog um today it is thursday and it's very early in the morning as you can probably tell by my voice i look very blue i don't know what what's going on with this lighting um yeah it's just gone eight in the morning and today i'm doing something quite exciting um my group at uni are off to london for the day so Basically, we're going to the V&A Museum. Um, we're going to see the Balenciaga exhibition, which should be fun. I've never really done anything like that before. Um, and then we're also just going to be having like, a girly day, getting some lunch, doing some shopping, that kind of thing. I think we're heading to Oxford Street and we're going to spend lots of unnecessary money. So that should be fun. I need to leave in a minute to meet uh, my course mates and then we're getting on a coach. So we're getting a coach from Southampton to London. I think it takes about two hours, so I want to go to co-op first and get some snacks. I have just made a couple of wraps to put in my bag to eat if I get hungry, but we should be there by about half ten-ish, so I just feel like I need a couple of snacks to keep me going. I've got my headphones, I've got my bag packed, um, I'm just taking my little Zara rucksack, which I filled with lots of things to keep me entertained on the coach journey. Um, to be honest, I'm probably just going to go to sleep on the bus i probably am um i'll show you guys what i'm wearing quickly so i haven't got anything majorly exciting on i wanted to keep things quite casual i've got this little bit of hair that keeps sticking off on my head um yeah so i've got this orangey kind of like burnt orange top on which is from zara um i've got this jacket which is also from zara it's basically just like a blue denim jacket with um leopard print collar which i'm obsessed with at the moment and then i've got athos jeans and then just my what are these even called Reebok Classics and that's it and I've just put some hoops in and done my makeup and I'm ready to go. Hello everyone, so you can probably tell that it is now the next day, um, I've just finished getting ready for the day, well I've had a shower and I've washed my hair and I've just finished doing my makeup um, and I basically realised that I was supposed to finish off the vlog last night when I got home. Um, because I know that I didn't really film that much in the end when I was in London yesterday so I thought I'd have a little catch up with you guys this morning and just explain so yeah we had a really really nice day in London the main reason we were going was to go to the V&A so the Victoria and Albert Museum and go to the Balenciaga exhibition because basically for my uni course we have to write up a review about like an exhibition or something and so my lecturer chose that one for us to go and see um, so we went and looked around that. I don't particularly find stuff like that interesting. Like I don't really like going to exhibitions and galleries and museums and that kind of thing. So I didn't love it. Um, it was okay and I kind of took it all in because I knew I had to for, um, for my essay. But apart from that, I was just... I just wanted to go shopping on Oxford Street. Um, so basically we finished in the museum and then we went to... Got back on the coach and went to Oxford Street and started doing a bit of shopping and then we did some shopping for a couple of hours. Um, I got some stuff in Too Faced and also a few bits from MAC because we obviously are like makeup students or whatever so we get a bit of a discount so we went to MAC and had a little shop around. Um, so yeah we did that. I'll show you guys what I got actually because I feel like it might interest you. I've just popped you in the windowsill so I don't have to hold my camera anymore because I'm lazy. Um, the first thing I got from MAC was another Pro Long Wear Concealer. I get this in the shade NW15 and it's basically one of my all time favourite concealers. I love it. It just comes in a little tube like this with a little pump on the top um, and basically I love this concealer I've almost run out of my one that I'm using at the moment so I thought I'd get another one just to make the most of the discount um, also from MAC I got a couple of little sample pots of just like glitters um, to use on some of my projects for uni um, and then I got a little quad of eyeshadows but I only got two to go in it so the first shade is this one here which I believe is called 
star something really helpful star violet it might be called um i'll show you what it looks like don't know how well you're going to be able to see this probably isn't working it's basically like a really gorgeous um can you see that it's basically a really really gorgeous kind of like brownie reddy purpley color almost um and then the other color is in the shade swish um which is this one here it's more of like a pinky color so this one here it's kind of like a pinky highlightery shade i know this is really rubbish lighting so i do apologize i'm sure i'll be using them in a video at some point so you'll see them it also popped into debenhams which had a two face counter so the first thing i treated myself to was one of their melted matte uh, liquid lipsticks which I'm yet to try this is in the shade child star and I really really liked the packaging um, me and my friend Imogen who's also on my course we both got the same color I did kind of copy her but I feel like it's a really nice neutral shade so I thought I'd try that they also had 10% off in Debenhams as well so it was like 17 pounds oh crap um, and then I also got one of the Too Faced lip injections because it's supposed to be really really good at plumping your lips it's basically just a clear lip gloss it looks kind of pinky in the tube actually maybe it is slightly pink um but yeah it's supposed to just plump your lips and so i thought i would give it a go so yeah they were the bits that i picked up in london i didn't go mad but i did just think i should treat myself to a few things um it is currently what time is it it is almost 20 past 11 um, I've had a bit of breakfast and basically i've got a whole list of things to do today um i've written a list down on my desk and yeah basically I need to strip my bed off and wash my sheets I've got so much other washing to do as well so I need to do that um, finish off this vlog so basically what I was trying to say in the beginning was because I didn't film that much yesterday um, I think I'm going to try and just film a little bit today um, it's probably not going to be particularly exciting because I'm literally just doing like food shopping hoovering cleaning my room and then a bit of uni work but I'll carry my camera around with me and see see what I can get filmed for you guys um sorry if I keep playing with my hair I'm trying to get it to dry because I hate blow drying it and obviously I don't want to go outside with really wet hair so I'm like trying to make it dry um but yeah so I've got a few bits to do I need to do washing food shop hoover my room just tidy my room in general and then I've also got loads and loads of uni work to do so I need to get that done but I just thought I would have a little chat with you guys and explain that I just didn't really film much yesterday I just I wasn't really feeling it and when we went into like Oxford Street and we were shopping I could have filmed a few bits then but it was just so busy and I just couldn't really be bothered if I'm honest with you so I'm just going to finish the vlog off today I hope you don't mind um I think that's all I've got to say I need to get ready for the day now so I finished getting ready and I'm dressed for the day I've basically just dried my hair roughly straightened it and shoved the top bit up in a bun like I always do it looks super messy but never mind I'm not really doing much today um I have stripped my bed as you can see and I've been uh, doing my washing for like the last hour or so I basically washed it and now it's in the tumble dryer so I'm just waiting to go and get that and then I'm gonna make my bed put all my washing away and then head into town and I think I'm gonna go to Starbucks um, or some sort of like coffee shop and take my laptop with me and try and get a little bit of uni work done because I need to start writing up about the exhibition yesterday before it exits my mind which is already happening um and i've got loads of other stuff to do for other projects as well so i'm gonna do that i'll probably take you along with me when i go into town it won't be a very interesting i doubt but um i'm trying to make this vlog a little bit longer for you guys so yeah that's what's happening
Okay, so I am all done in my room. I've finished um, sorting out all of my washing, like putting it away, and I've done my bed. So I've got fresh bedding on there, which I'm very excited to get into tonight. Um, but I've just put a jacket on and a few accessories and stuff, and I've got my bag together, and I'm going to head into town. Um, I'm going to go and sit in a coffee shop and get a little bit of uni work done because I can't focus when I'm in the flat. There's too much noise and distractions, so I'm going to take myself into town, and then I'm also going to go food shopping after, actually. I mustn't forget my shopping list um but i just thought i'd quickly show you guys what i am wearing because some of you might be interested in knowing where my clothes are from can i get this in my pocket yes okay let me show you so as usual it is a very casual outfit uh, my hoop earrings are from claire's uh, my jacket is top shop my top is from zara um it's very see-through actually you can basically see my bra through it that's not good um i've got uh top shop mum jeans I've got a belt from Urban Outfitters and then my Reebok Classics as usual and then I've also got my watch on which is Daniel Wellington. Basically, um, the company sent it to me, are you going to focus? Yeah, the company sent it to me a little while back and like I've said in videos before, I've literally worn it every day since. Um, if you want to check their watches out then I'll leave a link down below to their website. You can also get 15% off if you use a code which I will also leave in the description box down below but yeah, I'm going to head into town now and get some work done, hopefully. Probably not, I'll probably just drink coffee and pretend to do some stuff on my laptop. <laughs> Okay, so it is now the evening as you can probably tell because I'm dressed up and I'm ready to go out uh, Me and my flatmate Erin are gonna be just going out to a pub or like a bar and having a few drinks And then our other friend Josh is meeting us in a bit um, I just realized that I didn't really film that much today. I think I got a few clips when I was out um, But I went to Starbucks. I did a little bit of work. I got quite a bit done, which I was really happy with I looked around the shops. I went to Asda, did my food shop, came back, had a shower, had some dinner and then I got ready and yeah, we're gonna head out. But I thought I would just sit and finish the vlog whilst I remember because otherwise I'll go to edit it tomorrow. And I probably won't have like finished it and done a little ending. So I thought I'd do that now. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know it probably wasn't that long or particularly interesting, but thank you very much if you stayed till the end and you're watching this clip. Um, please remember to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I'm really bad at holding this camera, it really hurts my arms. Um, but yes, thank you, I'm being wrong. Who's ringing me? Josh is ringing me one sec. Hello? You right? We're still in the flat at the moment. Yeah, but we're gonna be leaving in like 10 minutes, so it's up to you. Did you wanna come meet us and then? Sorry about that, Josh was just ringing me. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Please remember to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in a couple of days with another video. Goodbye.